It's time to make a prediction. So you've learned that populations can change over time. Here's a new starting population, population B. I want you to predict what do you think population B will look like after 50 generations and why? Write it down or share with whoever you're sharing with. Now that you've made your prediction, let's see what happens to population B. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and load fur and temperature B mode. Just like population A, the start is a warm environment. We're going to turn it to cold. Our starting population has different variation than population A. Population B, all of our australopes have fur level one and fur level two. Okay, so you can see how this population is a little bit different. So let's go ahead and run and see what happens to our australopes. So our starting population, we have mostly one and a little bit of two. We've decreased already in by generation six. So we're down to 11 australopes with fur level two, and seven, right? So you can see they're shivering. Some of them are able to eat and reproduce but it doesn't seem like they live very long. We're down to two australopes after only 15 generations. And we're down to one, oh, and no australopes. Okay, so after 20 generations, we have no more australopes. Did this match your prediction? Why or why not? What you saw with our two australope populations leads us to two more key concepts. Go ahead and record these wherever you're keeping track of your natural selection key concepts. Over many generations, individuals with adaptive traits become more common in a population, while individuals with non-adaptive traits become less common. You saw this in population A, where there was a lot of variation in the population at the beginning, but by the end, only the australopes with a lot of fur survived. And our second key concept, the traits that exist in a population determine which traits can become more common over many generations. You saw this in population B, where we started with only fur level one and two. They weren't able to survive, and so the australopes went extinct. They weren't able to grow more fur because that wasn't a trait that was already in the population.